Once again, guys, I had friends coming over and decided to make up this absolutely stunning and delicious ratatouille. It came out incredible. So let me show you how to do this. So what you're going to do first is roast up some veggies, starting with a couple of red bell peppers, along with a quartered up tomato or tomato, however you want to say that. A quartered onion. Now this is a white onion. You can use red if you like too. And about five cloves of garlic. Now this is going into a 450 degree Fahrenheit preheated oven for about 25 minutes. After about 25 or 30 minutes, we're fairly well roasted here. So we're just going to slip everything into a blender. And some people may say, I know there's some people that are going to say, why didn't you clean up those bell peppers? Well, they're going into a blender, you know, brrr. So I'm sure some of that stuff is good for you and they're just going to be fine. Mmm, this smells good. And of course some salt. Yeah, about half a teaspoon, a teaspoon. Ground black pepper. A few sprigs of fresh rosemary. You can use dry too if you like. And a good drizzle of me olive oil. And we'll just puree this up until a wonderful, beautiful sauce forms. Now I'm just going to pour some of that wonderful sauce, and this tastes so good, into the bottom of my cast iron pan. Then just kind of take a spoon and smooth this out. Oh my goodness, guys. Absolutely fantastical. A bit more sauce. Alrighty then, let's start working on our veggies, beginning with our yellow zucchini. So I'm just going to go ahead and slice this up fairly thinly. Something like that. Same thing with our green zucchini. Now some people use a mandolin with these, but I'm just going to use a knife. Look at those colors, guys. Absolutely stunning. Of course, an eggplant. A tomato, and I know I should actually have used Roma, but I couldn't Roma that far. And I should mention too, guys, that a lot of people blanch these tomatoes and take the skins off. But I'm going to leave the skins on. I kind of like them. Now we're going to start to build our ratatouille by first with a yellow zucchini, a green zucchini, an eggplant, and a tomato or tomato and slip it on the side of the pan into our sauce. Oh, that looks good. Some of my French friends out there are going to say this is not ratatouille. And you're right, it's not really because it's traditionally a stew, but it is our version. It's colorful, beautiful, and delicious. Now I'm going to go into the center here. And of course, you know, you can do your own pattern however you like it. A wee bit of fresh parsley over the top. Oh, wow and a drizzle of olive oil. And just look at this, guys, the final product or the finished product. Doesn't it look absolutely stunningly beautiful? Come on, you want to just take a picture of this and put it on your wall type of thing. Okay, now this is going back into the oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit, 200 degrees Celsius. After 20 minutes, guys, just look at this. Absolutely stunning. Oh. I can't believe it. Yum. And there you have it, guys. Our absolutely stunning, wonderful, healthy, incredibly yummy ratatouille. All right, my friends, let's go ahead and grab some of this up. Make sure I get a little bit of everything here. Mmm, just look at this. Absolutely incredible. <laughs> it's going to be so good. Okay, let's go ahead and chow down. Mm. I just love this. The veggies. Still got a little bit of a crunch to them, just fantastic. And that sauce is simply to die for. Mm. Just love it. You gotta try this, guys. Just incredible. Yum. Mm. More, of course. Mm.